There go a horse, he at the bar. Two fish, sleeping in stars, head in the stars, head in the clouds. Look at them teeth, oh, grr, rawr. Look at this bunny, he is so sleep. You face is so funny. Look at this dude, he finna poot. Ladies and gentlemen, before I even salute you with a what? Listen, I played a little bit. <laughs> Y'all are like, bro, isn't that your job? No, 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 but look, okay, let me, I'm just a little goofy right now, bro. I just slammed both of these. I slammed both of these, bro. Yes, sir. Who needs liquor when you got these? So y'all, I recorded like 30 minutes of this. I got to the second save point after this stop, right? You're looking at the time right here, 50 minutes. Ain't no way, ain't no way. Who is that on the bottom left? Who is that? Why is bro standing like this? Why bro? With his tongue out too. Like you are not a bad bitch. He might be. What? Good job, look at that. Hey, to another episode of The Undertale, bro. I had to restart the entire game. And I tried to get here as fast as I can back to this spot. And I tried to remember, Berlin, did you kill Snowden? Did you kill, um, Froggit? Did you kill, um, the dude with the ice hat? I know I killed, um, Doggo. A body Doggo. Even though I knew I could have just sat still, you know what I mean? So, um, when it came to Lesser Dog, before I ended last episode, y'all saw plenty of ice all over the ground because that was, that was his body, bro. But because I spared Lesser Dog because I was just trying to get back to this spot quickly, Look at this nigga here, bro. This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. So what I was doing was creating art. Y'all always in the comments, Berlin. You don't even say my name like that. Yes, you do, some of you. Berlizzi, you don't have to kill everybody. You're ruining the game for me. Like, bro, you've played this like eight times, watched four YouTubers. I'm hoping that I didn't change too much of the story. I don't think I did. But um, when I got to this spot, I was like, where's all the ice dog at? And here he is, happy, alive. Now, hold on, though. One thing I did notice last time, she kind of bad, though. You know what I mean? Because check her out. She got the purple eyeliner to match the lipstick. She got, she got a handlebar mustache. I didn't notice that the first time through. She's got the purple sweater vest it was with a little bit of midriff showing. Oh! And then I don't know what it, at the belt line is that like udders. I don't know if that's a zipper. It could be Undertale like Gucci, Louis Vuitton. I'm getting like um railroad track vibe though. But she got the little leggings and you see her leg is a little tw twisted up too. Lesser dog, spit at her. She kind of cool. Spit game, bro. Let him do it. He gonna... Pfft. That dog considers itself an artist but doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Say it to his face. Say it to his face. Oh, you fake yourself. I can't, I can't rock with a chick like that. Now look at this. Easy work. I, it confused me at the start. Easy work. Check me out. I know y'all are mad. I know how to do this now. Yup. I already got to the second save spot. After that, it's a wrap though. Yup. Oh my gosh! I haven't sang any song. Let me think, what else have y'all tried to tell me about this game that you shouldn't have because you were spoiling my experience? Now look. Excellent, and the music stopped. Now look, I understand, like there's, y'all told me there's, there's a, there's a pacifist playthrough and then there's a, what else is it? Um, there is a, a uh, genocide playthrough. Hold on. What's up? Okay. Look, I'm 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 lawful neutral with this playthrough. If they do wrong to me, I got to do wrong back. Say, are you following me? That might not even be what what lawful neutral means. Gift trot, gift trot confronts you. I already know how to do this. Let's check him out though as if I didn't. Gift trot attack 16 defense 8. Some teens decorated it as a prank. Now, how come Papyrus ain't worried about them? You know what I mean? If, if there's other teenagers here, but you're pressed over me. Get your city, bro. 
Leave me alone. No, oh, damn. Whoa. Okay. Jeff tried to trust your youthful demeanor. Oh, I understand. So look, 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 look. Let's just take that stuff off of you, bro. You remove the striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. Everything recording, cool. That's a little better. You know what I noticed my first time though? Bro, what's up with his mouth? It like close and expand, but what's up with the shape though, bro? Jip Trot is slightly less irritated. I got you, man. Relax. You removed the box of non-dog related raisins. That was Doggo that did that, bro. That's a little bit better. Okay. Oh my gosh. Jip Trot is slightly less irritated, bro. You, you gotta hit one of these, bro. You removed the lenticular bookmark of a smug teen winking. A weight has been lifted. Jip Trot's problems have been taken away and I'm gone. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah, 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 I like the vibe of this room. I just don't know how to get through the door. So we got four mushroom plants. Oh, you could turn the light off. Now does it open up the door? It's a, it's a door. The heck was that sound? I didn't hear that sound my first my first time through here, but I don't know what to do in there. So, I'm, bro, there's got to be something though, cause like, no, 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 I can come back here. I can come back here. I hope. Sans, you don't even do anything cool, bro. Papyrus is bodying your character right now. I need you to come in clutch in these next couple parts. It's a snow puff. Okay. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. And that's the thing about this game is like, why are you like this game is, is for memers. You got to love memes, create memes to really appreciate this game. Check me out. Or you wouldn't be you if you didn't loot. That's why I'm clicking every single thing because yeah, they're all going to say snow, 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 what? Snow puffs. But like one of these could be something cool like um like an igloo or um maybe the mountain is alive and when you when you click one of the pots it's actually a little patch of dandruff that's been irritating it bro this part okay 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 i'm only doing like preemptive dialogue because i, I told you i already did this this next part creep me out watch this why are you horny like what are you doing that for thank you get out already I don't remember if I bodied him or not, but honestly, I'm doing it my way right now. It's the greater dog. Listen to his theme song. It should sound like a clown or... <laughs> I can't, bro. I can't, bro. There's too many of y'all now. I can't even get off my ridiculous jokes like I want to. I can't, I can't land it the way I want to. It sounds like clowns getting freak on at Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. That's what I was trying to say, but the words I would have chose would have made it way funnier. But there's too many of kids. There's too many kids here now. Y'all done all came over from TikTok. Uh, I'll be looking in the comments. She kind of bad though. Is that Frost though? She kind of bad though. Is that the Grim Reaper though? Like bro, you're late. But you're still welcome. Here, get you a sip. It's the greater dog. All right. I don't even remember how to, how to deal with you. Greater dog. It's so excited that it thinks fighting is just play. You're okay. Well, I figured out how to do it. I'm just going to ignore you then. We're, we're not going to fight. We're not going to play. Look at him. <laughs> greater dog inches closer. I didn't even notice your, your weapon is your dog. But I'm the, I'm, oh my gosh, give me a break. Greater dog just wants affection. Greater dog can find it in another dog. You notice dogs don't ever ask other dogs to pet them. Greater dog just wants affection. Greater dog, move, bro. Get up from down there, bro. I don't know what your plans are, but save that shit for lesser dog. Greater dog is making puppy dog eyes. Dude. If I play with him, is he gonna? Cause I clicked ignore the whole. Uh, Greater dog is not excited enough to play with. Okay, that's why I ignored you, bro. And then you hit me again. 
Before you go, before you go, take this with you. Yup. Before you go, take that with you. Good shit. Because I thought for sure you was going to turn blue on me. Oh my gosh, you went all the way to the start. Oh, brother, bro. And then the fact that I'm getting hit with all this, with this track. It sound like Pennywise at the park with his son. It's like, bro, just because you're at the park now doesn't mean you didn't kill everybody in your movies. Fuck you. And take your song out of here with you. Greater dog decides you are too boring. He even has a dog timepiece on his wrist. Like he was running like he was he was in a nightmare. Like <laughs> I hate those dreams. I don't really get them anymore. I think my brain kind of got over that kind of narrative for itself. Here we go. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. Who else does a better papyrus than me? Pause, pause. Okay, so he got Wrecking Ball, Arrow. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute, that's the dog from the doghouse. That tiny dog. I'm just not putting that together. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will... What? Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! This man lives for me, bro. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, uh, I'm about to activate it now. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems uh, maybe uh, too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Whew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. <laughs> Y'all <laughs> uh. <laughs> see I got my striped shirt on too I didn't even point that out bruh Ugh. I was looking in my closet I'm like I don't have any Freddy Krueger uh, <clears throat> Freddy Krueger swag in here I tried though Here we go I don't know what my brother's gonna do now If I were you I would make sure I understand Blue attacks Maybe you should tell your, your brother I'm not a blood bro I don't gangbang the fact that you even told me that lets me know he's gonna press me in the street. Is this whole game in snow? Welcome to Snowden! Yay! Wait, I called I called an enemy Snowden. I meant um what's the dude with the Dorito head? You know what I mean? Not Phineas, bro, not Phineas. Okay, this is where I stopped. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. That's not true. I went I went into the inn. No 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 no. I went into a restaurant or a bar. Somebody put it on me, bro. And that's when I cut the game off. Hey, hey, hey. I forgot. I forgot, bro. It's so fun doing this a second time through. I know y'all recognize this beat from TikTok, man. I'm sitting here listening to it. I'm like, I'm waiting for that. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? You can help me by um telling me is that a undershirt or you got taco meat hanging out the top? I'm just gonna assume you black though, because with that hat you got some, you got a little bit of TI swag going. A little bit of Gilligan's Island, Bob the Builder. Uh <laughs> what would you like to buy? So this is the thing. We've already discussed there's plenty of options. Kill everyone, save everyone. Look, I don't know who I'm going to spare yet, okay? Look, if you was looking for a, a playthrough like that, go 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 play it yourself. 
Because I didn't buy the tough glove earlier, but I, I think I'm going to buy it. Somebody might need to get slapped. Armor. Yeah, get manly bandana. Just look. Yeah, I want it. You see, I'm shopping. Okay. B bicycle. Bicycle. I don't know. It it's the spelling. I'm like, what? It, got it can't say the same thing. Right? Okay, I'm out of here. So look, I talked with her last time and she was just like, this is a town. If you get bored, there's two um, skeleton brothers. They, they're they cool, talk to them. My, my sister owns the inn next door. But bye now, come, come again sometime. I'm not finna waste my time with pointing this dialogue with her when I've already seen it. You know, anybody else, I got you. Welcome, oh, I got you. Welcome to Snowed Inn. Whoops, one night is 80 G's. I don't, I don't think I think only got like two. You don't even have 80 G's. Oh, you poor thing. I can only imagine what you've been through. One of the rooms upstairs is empty. You can sleep there for free, okay? Thank you, girl. This was me in real life. I'm walking downstairs complaining and I'm gonna say, your turn to pay me. And then, and then when she give me my bread back, I'm going right back up to the room, covering both pillows, covering both ears with pillows and getting my full eight hours. You paid me to sleep here. You think I wanna hear, um. Beethoven and, and, and snore, bro? Hiya, you look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Feel free to come back if you get tired. Crazy part is I just did all that ranting. I didn't even pay for the night's sleep. Still to complain, no. That's just me. I do it. <laughs> I'm a complainer. Dude. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? You're not teaching your daughter any type of social skills, having her just study customers with no nose or mouth showing. Man, tell her to say hello when elders walk in the motherfucking room. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hey, hey. This is a big ass town, hold on bro. Don't wanna to walk to the other side of the town? Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. This dude up here on the right is fried, bro. He done seen some things, bro. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Is she out here in booty shorts? Toby Fox, why did you make her a little thick? Come on, bro. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. <laughs> Why is she kind of awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns? So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Guess it was a good thing those teens tormented that monster. Last but not least, I wanted to introduce you to my friend here. Um, I didn't know that um the Pac-Man family was staying in Snowden. We got Pac-Man daughter. Um, she built a little weird, she looked like a lemon head mixed in with beehive chest, Maggie and the Ferocious Beast face. She needs sleep. And the way she's just looking at us is like not cool, bro. Nope, it's actually a dinosaur. My bad. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. <laughs> I wonder if that weird skeleton is an adult or a kid. <laughs> you know kids be laughing at the dumbest shit, bro. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. I don't get that one.
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And we're back to where I was. When I leave this place, I don't know where I'm going. I hope I'm going snoring. I need to get a nap like them people at the bar. Who this big old heart? Easy gang to go. I had it, bro. I just needed one more word to rhyme. Johnny Ghost would just flip that shit, bro. Grill bees. When I walk up, get a drink. All the homies look at me. They be like, ooh, that sweater clean. Yeah, Freddy Cougar, bitch. I'm in there. And what's up? Yeah, I see two dogs with some with some big old pause, pause, man. Damn, man. One more bar. Here we go. Let me switch the flow up. There go a horse. He at the bar. Two fish sleeping in stars. Head in the stars. Head in the clouds. Look at them teeth. Oh, girl. Rawr. Look at this bunny. He is so sleep. You face is so funny. Look at this dude. He finna poot. That's why I cut this shit off earlier, bro. That's exactly why I cut it off. God, let us be cold. Ooh, we, we up at Grill Bees. Take a seat, get you something to drink. You could play some cars with my nigga Doggo. Or drink away all your sorrows. Uh, if you want some company, come fuck with me. Easy game, the company, come fuck with us. We love to fuck. <laughs> That's why, that's, honestly, stop telling me to freestyle the beats. Friday Night Funkin' coming soon. Ah, the capital's getting pretty crowded. So I've heard they're going to start moving here. Mm. I don't want to see the eraser of our local culture. But I definitely want to see some city slickers slip on the butts. <laughs> you know what, you have just like, um, dude from outside. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and hot guys. Okay. I can't tell if you're, I'm not gonna assume, but get, get what you need. Hmm. Isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. Let me get a drink, bro. I'm thirsty. What, she racist? Groobs said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I guess because he doesn't have a mouthpiece either, he can't talk to me. Because how did he know all of your orders? You know what I mean? That's... Just kidding, y'all, because some of y'all will get in the comments. Oh, my God. Here he goes about race again. Everything is about black people. Like, bro, it's a joke, man. Laugh. Damn. It's a joke. Laugh. It's a joke. Laugh. It's a joke. Laugh. It's a joke. Laugh. It's a joke. Joke, joke, laugh. You know what I mean, bro? Like, laugh. I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there's plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going to make out with a fish. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> he is down bad. He is down tremendous. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. You can, you can say they appear. You don't got to call it it, bro, just because you don't understand them. You see what I'm saying? Like... Where's Dago? I hope he didn't get lost again. Oh, I killed Doggo. I killed Doggo. I didn't catch that the first time. I killed Doggo. That's why he's not here. Oh, that hurts. That hurts. That hurts. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. Oh, yeah, because he wanted to play the whole time. Like, this ain't no um, clubhouse, bro. I couldn't even sit down if I wanted to, bro. I'm gonna sit around right here. I can't even, all right, I'm gone. Matter of fact, let me see what's on the jukebox. The jukebox is, okay. Grillbees is lit. I love Grillbees. Who is this? Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes. Trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness, crowding. Lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. 
Bro, if you just relaxed your bowels, maybe you could just think better. You and your you and your brain. You got you got to get in your body and and loosen up. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyway. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? That'd be the last time I talked to you, sir. Um, let's see where else we can go. The library. The library, bro. Okay, so you got um who is this working the front desk? A bush. Okay, Mike Lazowski, what's the deal? That look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't you? Okay, I'm not gonna I'm not coming in to get this disrespected. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. Okay, because I'm thinking I'm looking at Toby like I, I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we just fill it with comics and games. Bro, then call it a comic. <coughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. And I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. Love, hope, compassion. This is what people say monster souls are made of. But the absolute nature of soul is unknown. After all, humans have proven their souls don't need these things to exist. Why are they throwing the word soul at me, at me so many times, bro? Uh, you know what's crazy? Y'all have taken the word soul from me. And now, I, now all I can picture in my mind, Joe Gardner. Like, bro, I don't want to see Joe Gardner when I think about the afterlife. No, oh, I'm gone. This place. Hold on, hold on. Let me check the light. Let me check the books. It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. When monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on that person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kind of sick of writing this. I don't want to grimace too much because I feel like that might be somebody's culture IRL and like do you do you just know it just know if y'all decide when when my time has come bro and y'all cremate me put me in a little urn throw me over a um another person while monsters are mostly made of magic human beings are mostly made of water humans with their physical forms are far stronger than us but they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic they'll never get a bullet pattern birthday card because they are made of magic, monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken, and the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill, um, that's in the chapter here. Oh, maybe that's why Toriel got like weaker and weaker the more I was beating her ass earlier. Monster History Part Four. Fearing the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city, home. We braved harsh, cold, damp, harsh, cold, da damp swampland and searing heat until we reached what we call our capital, new home. Again, our king is really bad at names. Thank you for the information. I'm gone. Damn, who? This looks like my mailbox. High key. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled papyrus. Oh, okay, then we know. Can we look inside Sans? Who be writing Sans this much, y'all? Y'all love this man, bro. But y'all don't ever write papyrus, though. It's locked. I made it to the other side of the city already. It's locked from the inside. Boo, I wasn't done yet. Boo. Oh, it's too cold. I'm finna die. No, no. Am I, am I gonna die? Am I gonna get hurt? No, no. Okay, no, it's supposed to happen. Cool, 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 cool. What you got going on, Papyrus? Uh -huh. You cool? Oh, human. Uh -huh. Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Uh -huh. Feelings like uh -huh. the joy. What is he? Is I don't want this interaction. What do I do? I don't want this interaction. I'm uncomfortable. Please stop. 
the joy of finding another pasta lover. Stop. The admiration for another's puzzle solving skills. Stop. In a sentimental mood. Only OGs know why I sang that one, bro. Look at us. <laughs> the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. Oh, okay. It's on some friend. It's on some friend. Cool, cool, cool. These feelings. They must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be to like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not! You shall be lonely no longer. I, the great papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus. The newest member of the Royal Guard. Papyrus, I'm not about to kill you, bro. I didn't even want to go this way. Why did I? Why didn't I just stop and turn around? There was a whole other path going up, man. Okay, he likes to say, "Nah." <laughs> okay. What? What you got going? Are those okay? You are weak, boy. Man, Papyrus is rattling his bones. I'm about to insult you. How selfless. You want me to feel better about fighting you? I don't deserve such hospitality from you. Um, I'm about to just try and leave. Smells like bones. Okay. I'm gonna keep it. Oh my gosh, it is on that type of time. What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. Who would ever choose this? Who would ever say that? I can make spaghetti. That might be a cold line in the future. Okay, okay. Let me let me think about that. So what what this game is telling me is, I approach someone. I say. I like you. They say, I have high standards. I'm gonna say, but I can make some spaghetti though. But the thing is, yo, my mom told me about spaghetti. Y'all, you ladies ain't finna catch me with no plate of spaghetti. Oh, I'm about to put y'all onto super game. But the, the sad part is, this is a kid's game. Just remember, Uncle Berlizzi told you this one, bro. I can't talk about this, bro. Just look up spaghetti in relationships. I can't, I, no, no, I'm not, I'm not getting into that. Some of y'all know what's up though. Some of y'all old ones, y'all know what's up, bro. Oh no, you're meeting all my standards. I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date later after I capture you. What kind of attack is that? Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh no! Let's take later after I capture you. Dude, he's not falling for it. He still wanna capture me. I'm gone. Insult him now, insult him. There's no need to lie to yourself. Your barbs hide a hidden affection. You emotional cactus. <laughs> emotional cactus? This dude is well read, bro. There's no way he's just this, he, he's just off the dome with this kind of this kind this kind of game. Papyrus dabs some bone cologne behind his ear. Oh my gosh, that sounds horrible. Don't, don't waste your words on me.
Papyrus dabs marinara sauce behind his ear. I don't like the underground. This city blows. You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't escalate this battle. Let's date later after I capture you. I don't want to kill him, bro. I know you said that, but I just wanted to try again. I'm gonna leave. I'm about to just try and leave, bro. I gotta get ready for my date, sir. So you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. What? You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> You're blue now. Uh oh. Hmm. I wonder what I should wear. Oh, I, oh, this is a jump now? Okay, now I see why, why, okay, I get it. Insult him. Papyrus is too busy fighting to accept your insult. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. Oh my gosh, bro. You're getting mixed. MTT brand beauty yogurt, yeah, dude. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. I'm here, I'm here for it. What's up? Papyrus realizes he doesn't have ears. <laughs> Why didn't I catch that? I can almost taste my future popularity. I can't tell if is if leaving is working or not. You a bitch for that one. I'm gonna hit him back then. Papyrus, head of the royal guard. I, I know Toby made a head joke with that one. I'm I'm a. You ain't slick, bro. I'm not getting any new uh, hints, bro. Oh my gosh, I short hopped, really? Dude, I don't wanna, I don't wanna fight you, man. Oh my Lord. I'm out of here. Dude. Y'all said I, I... How do I get him to do the, the special attack? I, my brother will... Well, he won't change very much. Because he's saying he has another attack. Maybe if I... Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Pause on this one. Oh my lord. You got me playing, playing Flappy Bird, bro. Why are you whistling? Then I, I just gotta beat his ass. I just gotta beat his ass then, bro. I was not trying to fight him, but he's he's like that's that's what he wants, bro. And he and he hurt me. Dude. I'm I'm 
Oh, brother. Dude, I don't want to fight. I don't want to do this, man. Nothing's working. I tried to, to hit him, but not hit him. He just want to. He just want to fight, man. Give up or face my special attack. Yeah. Very soon I will use my special attack. Okay, good, 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 good. This is how we get progress. We got, we got to hit, we got to swing on them. Not too long and I will use that special attack. All right, bro, use it, man. You ain't saying nothing. What even are those? Candlesticks? I, I think they're supposed to be bones. Bro, nobody give a damn about no special attack, bro. I'm gonna leave as soon as you as soon as you use it. Where is Sans at? Yeah, eat it! Eat it! Behold my special attack! What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey! You stupid dog! Oh the bone! Look at, look at that dog face. That is pumpkin, bro. It don't matter what she has. A shoe, a shirt, a toy, a treat I gave her. Like, bro, why are you scared? Like, I'm going to, like, I just gave it to you. Why are you still big eyed and scared? Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, I tried to help you, Papyrus. Let me leave now, man. Come back here with my special attack. Oh well, I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Bro, I'm leaving, bro. <sighs> Here's an absolutely normal attack. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. 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 Cool, dude. Okay. Bro! Oh, nice. Nice. This game is ridiculous. Please don't kill me, bro. I got seven HP, man. Please stop. I don't trust that. I don't trust that. I don't trust that. I don't trust him. I don't trust him. <clears throat> well, um... It's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah. Oh, uh, there it goes. There goes the hiccups. I told you. I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare. Oh, God. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Okay. Goodbye. I don't know if I can keep doing his voice this episode. I'll, I'll, I'll recover. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I don't know who Undyne is, but I remember uh, Toriel said, watch out for some dude named Asgore, so. I'll, I'll never join the Royal Guard. And my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. That's so foul. I would never in a million years. What should you say? Let's be friends, bro. I gotta turn up for this. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess, I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, we, <clears throat> we haven't even had our first date. And I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> I love that. I love that. I'm here for that. I'm here for that, bro. You go on a date and look for the friend zone. 
I'm only here for that during my current stage of life. When it's time to lock down the one and I'm ready to plant my seed in fertile grounds. Oh, my tip. Then no, I'm not trying to hit no friends on on a date, bro. But for right now, yeah, man. What's up? Be my friend. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? Bro, friend dates need to be a... Th we can't even go nowhere. Let me shut up. I was gonna say, friend things need to be a thing, bro. Let's see a PG about it, bro. Hey, bro, um... What's up, bro? Hey, bro, you trying to go on a date? Me? What you talking about, bro? <laughs> no, 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 about? no. It's friends, though. On that date... What you on, bro? I'll talk to you later, bro. Man, never again will I ever ask these niggas for fucking dates, bro. He laughed in my face, man. Maybe friend dates aren't the wave. All right, I hereby grant, oh, I'm sorry. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you! That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is. Well. He's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> Look at how he run when he get a date, bro. If that ain't us, all of us, bro. Don't act like, don't act like every single person out there just had a successful, undefeated record that you just may weather just shit through dates, bro. Impossible. So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. I'm trying to go. What is this, dude? My house! <laughs> I don't want to do this. What's going on in that room, bro? Yo, you don't have PS5? Let me check, bro. Where, where your Oculus Quest at, bro? It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Why is the sock... Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. It's a joke book. Oh, Lord. Take a look inside, I guess. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quant- Bro, don't don't have me do this. Thank you. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's most important in life. Bro, what's going on in here? The door is locked. That's gotta be Sans' room. And this gotta be Papyrus, bro. That's my room! If you finished looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do and they date no 
Hey man, hey man, I don't know if I made it clear to you, but um, I'm heterosexual and I, I apologize if I made you think that wasn't the case. Do you have anything you want to say? Welcome to Scenic My House. Enjoy and take your time. You said PS5 was in your room? Okay. His room kind of cool, but like, bro, I got to talk to him. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? What? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. Papyrus, can you put that music back on? You're making me feel uncomfortable. The internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Of course! Fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. There are no skeletons inside my closet! Except me sometimes. Bro, he's coming on to me, dude. That's him saying he'll, he comes outside of the closet sometimes. Oh no. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Okay. That book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. Dude, what is this, Papyrus? Talk about this. Isn't that flag neato? Undying found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> ah, yes, action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right, Santa! Papyrus, you are so cool, bro. But let me just remind you, bro. Uh, I don't, I don't play for the same team. I don't think you know. I, I play for the the, the straight, the straight and narrow, and you kind of play for the, for the curvy. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my... Son of... <laughs> of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. <laughs> Papyrus is so cool, bro. Even with, like, like, this minimal life that he has, he's so proud. You gotta respect it. Now... I guess it's time. I'm already here. Okay, dating start. What are we doing? What are we doing? Here we are on our date. Bro, I've actually never done this before. But don't worry. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one, press the C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. Wow, we, I feel so informed. What are we doing? I think we're ready for step two. Step two, ask them on a date. <laughs> Human, I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Sure, bro. Really? I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Okay, they've got, they kind of given us some game. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head.
You're wearing clothing right now! I did put on a bandana in the middle of that fight, bro. Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No, could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning! He's having such a great time, bro. No. You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! <laughs> Your dating power! <laughs> Don't think you bested! Why are we fighting? It's a date! Talk about yourself! Tell me something cool! I, the Great Papyrus, have never been beaten at dating and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. I don't know where this game is going. He's about to get naked. Oh shit, he came out kind of fresh. What do you think of my secret style? It's kind of cool. No, a genuine compliment. <laughs> that was so genuine. I'm like, I might need to copy that, copy that style for a video on school. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This date won't escalate any further. Unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Mm, I think it has to do with the font. The shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. The shirt didn't, okay, okay, sure, 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 sure. Got you, got you, heard you, yep. Um, I think the secret is this hat you trying to, you trying to, you, you want to be me so bad, bro. My hat, my hat, my hat. <laughs> well, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present, a present just for you. Sure. Is it spaghetti? That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But oh, so wrong. This ain't any old plain pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti finely aged in Oaken's cask. I think I'm ready to go to King's Castle now. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go on any further. You mean, you're letting me have it instead? Because you know how much I love pasta? Impossible! Taking my present and turning it around on me! Oh! Hickson, no more game requests for the rest of the year. Your request privileges have been revoked. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um. Boy, is, is it hot in here or is it just me? <laughs> oh, shoot, um, human, uh, I, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I tried very hard to. 
I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before, and instead, by dating you, I have only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. What's going on? Help me. I'll keep being your cool friend and act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Yeah, because I don't even have, I was just about to say that, bro. Like, what you gonna do? <laughs> like, bro, that's not a kiss, bro. That's, cla that's clapping uh, teeth, bro. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true, but I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonic. <laughs> well, gotta go. <laughs> Please don't come back again. I'm leaving. Goodbye. I don't give a damn about whose room that is on the right. I'm leaving. This is, oh, you know what though? I wanted to check that space upstairs. I mean, up the way. I'll be honest, that's, that's one of the most memorable dates I've ever been on in my life. Let's play Monsters and Humans. You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? Okay, well, I... Ah, to be young again. The world sure felt boundless. So you're telling me that's not a snow puff? I knew something was up, bro. And he got a mustache, but I know when y'all heard me say earlier about the mountain needing to be scratched dangerously. Whatever, you know what I'm trying to say. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Oh, my patience rewards me. Ah. Ah, bro. Open the door. Okay. Who is that? You got my nigga Sly Cooper in the game. It feel ominous. I don't like that. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we know what time it is. We are headed to King's Castle. Watch me get over there in his Bowser. Like, bro, Bowser, you need to find Peach or Mario and do some damage. Don't do damage to Peach, though, bro. That's my job. I mean, I, this ain't Mario game. I'm sorry. Let me be quiet. Let's just walk. Here we go. I'm jumping on that. Let me on that. Okay, I can't yet. Got you. Okay, so we are at that ominous part of the map that we just approached. Okay. Are you sneaking out to see her too? Awesome. <laughs> She's the coolest, right? <laughs> I want to be just like her when I grow up. <laughs> hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> I told you they'd be laughing every time. Kids is different, bro. Like, they just be goofing around. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Neat, huh? Neat, huh? Okay. The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep playing a little bit more. It's kind of cool. I'm having a blast. <laughs> what? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm gonna go to Grillby's. Wanna come? Mm, sure. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from work. Over here, I know a shortcut. Fast shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone. 
Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya. Hiya, Shanji. Hey, Sans. Weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? No, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Ah. <laughs> okay, I'm not mad at that one. Here, get comfy. Oh, that was a whoopee cushion? I'm like, this dog farted again, bro. Louder and longer, bro. Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on their seats. Anyway, let's order. Mm, what do you want? I want fries, bro. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grillby, we'll have a double order of fries, man. Uh, just that Grillby's chilling, bro. This is this kind of cool right now. Okay, Sans is cool. Sans is cool. I'll take back what I said earlier. So, what do you think? Of my brother. Oh, he cool. He cool. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wear that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh, well. At least he washes it. And by that, I mean he wears it in the shower. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Yeah, I'll, t I'll take some. Bon appetit. You tip the ketchup. The cap falls off and all the ketchup in the bottle pours onto your food. And the thing is, Sans knew that though. Like, why are you pranking with my food though? Like, like whoopee cushions is cool. Funny puns is cool. You fuck with my food, bro. Catch this left hook. Ouch. In the last like six months of my life, not even six, last like three months, bro. I had a crippling back injury, paralyzed me for at least a full 24 hours. My right shoulder, I can't really show you, but my right shoulder, bro, I, I, I tore my rotator cuff when I was maybe like four, five years ago. And it's been giving me the worst problems yet, bro. But I just turned 28. I'm not, I'm not 40, right? When, I, when we move to the new spot, y'all, we using the standing desk more often. If something ain't right. Whoops. Uh, forget about it. You can have mine. I, I'm not hungry anyway. What are you scratching boot for, bro? Anyway. Cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries really hard. Like how he keeps trying to be a part of the Royal Guard. One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh, still a work in progress, but, um, and eat your fries. Oh, yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yeah, that bitch ass flowy, bro. What you, what you got some intel? So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. Say something to him. Oh, oh, that flower, my bad. Say something to them and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Whoa! 
Oh, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat, bro. Can you foot the bill? It's just... Bro, you are a bitch. Just kidding. Oh, me too. My fault, bro. I didn't mean to call you that B word. I was just... You, you, you playing with my food and my money today, bro. Why? Grillby, put it on my tab. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. What a... <laughs> that's... That's Hickson in a nutshell. Hickson, I'm not, mad at, I'm not mad at your game prediction, bro. I'm not mad at this game. This game kind of cool. Why can't I take the shortcut back? What a... We really went on a date with Papyrus. Just for him to curve me. Like, bro, what a prick. All right. This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in a box. Sincerely, a box hater. Okay. Um, I wanted to do that because I was trying to see. Yep, I knew it. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Huh? There's a camera behind the waterfall. What? You know what? I don't even ask those kind of questions in this game anymore because it's like. Ooh, I wasn't even talking about that. There's a tutu lying on the ground here. Will you take it? You got the old tutu. Maybe uh is a girl. You equip the old tutu. I mean, not to say that like, you know, it's a problem with, with, with a dude wearing a tutu, you know? Cause I feel like, I feel like you could wear whatever you want to wear, but at the same time, like, I'm finna put my manly bandana back on just me personally. And that's all I'm saying, just me personally. <laughs> hi, 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 Undyne. Um, <clears throat> I'm here with my daily report. Uh, regarding that human I called you about earlier. Huh? <clears throat> did I fight them? Uh, yes! Of course I did! I fought them va- How do you say that word? Valiantly! What? <clears throat> Did I capture them? W well, um... No. I tried very hard on dying, but in the end, I failed. What? You're going to take the human soul yourself? But Undyne, you don't have to destroy them, you see. Y you see. Oh no. I understand. I'll help you in any way I can. Oh, oh my gosh, just scared the mess out of me. Oh, that's a pad? Bro, stay still, stay still. It's kind of a teal blue. Maybe that won't hit you either. Maybe it'll hit you slightly. He let me go, he let me go, he let me go, he let me go. You forgot your eyeball. Oh, there you go. There you go. Okay. I'm finna keep doing me. Fuck him. Fuck dude. Why are you? <laughs> Why did I know he like his character design, his player build was too iconic for him not to be trailing me, bro. He's talking about meeting up with some chick. Where? Who? Yo, uh, did you see the way she was staring at you? <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> I'm so jealous. Motherfucker! Why wasn't it me? I'm sorry. Uh, so what did you do to get her attention? <laughs> Tell me, please. Uh, yeah, I, I just want to know, man. I really fucking wanted her, you know? And the fact that she was looking at you. Oh, my parents are going to whoop my ass. <laughs> Come on. Let's, let's go watch her beat up some bad guys. And maybe I can fucking stab you with a fucking spine, you prick. Did he just bite the dust and I missed it? Damn. 
A feeling of dread hangs over you, but you stay determined. I'm ending it right there. I'm ending it right there. I'm ending it right there. Ladies and gentlemen, Hicks, Hicks, your game literally got, literally got saved in the last 20 minutes, bro. That whole date sequence. <laughs> so I'm just kidding, Toby, bro. Your game's fire, bro. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Look at the smile. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is episode number three of that Undertale. We're getting into the story now. Undyne has all that armor on, but I'm going to assume that is a luscious lady up under there, bro. I think by now, my playthrough is pretty neutral, right? But at the end of the series, I'm going to go through and I'm going to watch all the different endings if you would have saved everybody or killed everybody because I'm honestly curious. Music then turned up. Oh, yeah, we getting into it now. With that being said, bro, if you enjoyed this, make sure that you slap a like on that video before you go. Subscribe if you are new. Hit that bell so you always know when I'm posting vids. Love y'all, bro, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.